So today we're checking out some Sniper Ghost Warrior Contracts 2. It's a brand new sniper game that's just launched and considering how much I enjoy sniping in other games that I play, this one was a complete no-brainer. Now, CI Games have sponsored this video, really nice of them. There's a link at the top of the description that you can click right now for more information on Sniper Ghost Warrior Contracts 2. And we're going to be playing as a true sniper in this mission today. In the game, you take on the role of Raven. He is a contract sniper assassin and he's operating in a remote region in the Middle East. And the region that we're going to play in today is called Zindar Province. We've got to take down three key targets. Antoine Zaza, he's a warlord and a quartermaster. Former SAS officer Captain Ronald Payne, he's running a training camp. And then Colonel Novikov, who is a former GRU agent who controls supply and logistics. Now, these people are working for someone called Bibi Rashida, and she is the new ruler of Kuama, which is a fictitious state in the Middle East. She's managed to hold on to power after the death of her husband by befriending lots of her husband's closest allies. So, without further ado, let's get into it. Right, here we go. So, this is our first OP. And that's going to look right over the water to this kind of like encampment over here. Looks like we've got to work our way through some kind of low level section first. Roger that. Raven out. Here's somebody up front. Let's use my wall hack. There we go. Got some great camos on my guns. Definitely going to blend in. Now, just quickly. I'll search these. I have a good feeling about them. Just threw a rock at him. Oh, he's looking my way. In the head. Cover me! There we go. Dealt with. So this pistol's probably only good for taking people out super close. And you can loot everyone's bodies in this game. Obviously you need to because of the amount of limited ammunition you've got. And you do not want to be running out of sniper ammunition as uh, the game is called Sniper Ghost Warrior. So running out of ammunition would not be a great idea. Oh, somebody up here. Is there any point wasting a bullet on... Do you know what? There's no point wasting a bullet on that guy. I'll probably just sneak right up and get this guy. Make sure he doesn't hear me. Y'all ready for this? Oh, straight in the neck. Right, okay. Can definitely see some movement down here. These binoculars are brilliant. I'm heading for the binoculars did this in real life. Good. We just received some fresh intel on Zaza. He may be conducting a deal today. Ooh. Our sources tracked a known weapons supplier crossing the border earlier and heading on the main road to that location. If we're lucky, you'll catch them both. Do you have anything on the supplier's ETA? Interesting. Negative. But one of the locals may have more info. Look for a hostile stationed near one of the comms relays. I'm sure they've heard the chatter. And probably won't be asking him nicely. That's the comms relay. How you do it is up to you. Those barrels. Okay. That's an explosive right there. Well, I think we know what we're doing. <laughs> Gonna hit the explosive. That's one. This one goes right through the head. There's the bullet time. <laughs> There's a load of brain all over the screen. Lovely. That one didn't have the camera, but actually really enjoyed watching that bullet. That was nice. Oh, he just got blown off his feet. Missed. Hey, they're coming up towards me. Need a better angle. I can take them out with the AK. They know I'm here now. That's one. And that's two. One thing I've learned from this game so far is that um, if the music stops, you tend to be okay. <laughs> so I know that these guys, uh, there's no one else around. I appreciate games that uh, that do this, by the way. That put like little ropes to show you where you can climb. It's it's a way of not having to like put the HUD on the screen. So instead you can just, uh, you can just look for the rope. Anyone up here? Is that a man? It looks like one. Yeah, there we go. 
Should we do another melee takedown? Let's do another one. Hello, good sir. How are you today? Oh no, you're dead. Oh, right across the throat. Oh, that was hellish. Okay. Now, this is the kind of sniping I've been waiting for. Okay, let's mark some people. Well, not before Zaza is dead, at least. We got people on the roof. That's a sniper right there. They're one of the first people I need to take out because they'll shoot back at me. Because they'll actually be able to see me. Oh, that could be fun. That could be really fun. Now, if you look on the screen there, you'll see there's like a red dot on the sniper. This is like an in-game system that helps you, guides you to where to put the bullet. So you can see the bullet is just below the 1100 meter mark. I can hold my breath. That should be a headshot. This bullet's going a long way. Oh, straight through the back of the neck. More jam. The 1,111.6 meters that snipe was. That was a massive snipe. Absolutely huge. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to shoot this fuse box. Watch the bullet. Hit the fuse box. Boom. Someone's going to have to go and have a look at that. <laughs> Wonder if we could do this. Ready? Ah, the bullet's not strong enough to take it down, I don't think. There's a cooling control system up there. That could be interesting. Oh, there goes the fuse on that. <laughs> what was that? We have a short circuit in the fire protection system. Are you seeing this water all over my equipment? The sprinklers are activated, so... Control. Oh dear. Primary target. There's the target. Confirmed. That's Antoine Zaza. At this distance, it's not going to be easy. Even with all this fancy new gear. <laughs> Agreed. But the basics don't change. Get him stationary to improve your odds. I'll line him up somehow. He's going up to the roof, Good this luck. guy. Shit. I have no line of sight on the target. Blocked by a container. Can it be moved? Raven, we're tracking a vehicle on approach. Right side. There's a vehicle? Thanks for the heads up. Oh, okay. It's the same make and model we spotted earlier. It's the seller. I'll make sure he doesn't leave. <laughs> I got the weapons dealer. Hang on a minute. Oh, there's an opportunity here. Let's open the control doors. Is that going to open the doors? It is. Got to kill the guy at the back. The one we need. He's the one we need. Hopefully that hits him right in the head. It blew his hat off. Oh my god, it blew his hat off. Uh, and the weapons Target dealer slashed. is running. Zarza is down. I am not surprised he is running away from that. Not the record, though. Not this time. Besides, this op is off the books. See how far? Look, that bullet was behind the weapons dealer there. You might want to also yeah. take care of the dealer since he's already arrived. That was close. Can we get that? Be able to locate the dealer. Oh, it moved. The guy keeps moving because there's so much time between the bullet being fired. Oh, there you go. Nearly hit him. There we go. <laughs> we get the weapons dealer as well. Straight through the shoulder. Oh, I love those bullet time things. That was awesome. <laughs> Whoa. That was kind of cool. For those of you that don't know, by the way, this, this game is built on the Cry Engine, um, which is why it looks, at least up close here, like, like it, it looks really, really cool. I wonder, is he looking this way? No, he's not. Nighty night. Nighty night. Now, what I can do with this one, I was just going to say, is I could have interrogated him, but he turned around at the last minute. Well, apparently, there's a collectible here. If you look at the little mini map. HQ, this is Bravo Five Two. We have narrowed down hostiles' location. Over. There we go. Apparently, they've nailed down my location. Interesting. So I picked up a collectible there. Not sure actually what it was. Oh, okay. Okay, they seem to know exactly where I am, which is no good. 
did they get the information from me killing that guy? I mean, I, I'm going to have to sort something out. The guy needs to come off that mortar. Oh, here we go. Bullet time again. <laughs> I love these. Where have we landed the shot? Is it through the head? Oh, right through the base of the head. His head exploded. <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah, they spotted me. He's down. Oh, he moved at the last moment. Whoa, big explosion. Oh, he's on the he's on the mortar. Can't have you doing that. Sorry, buddy. Oh, just missed that headshot. Ouch. Just gonna regen a little. You will regen health over time. He's down. Didn't actually get a headshot on that guy. That's a headshot. Oh, it looks so cool. Again, his brain does... It just no longer exists. It just no longer exists. You moved at the last minute, Sonny Jim. You got so lucky. Boom. Take it down. Are there any more over the back here? No, I think he moved across to the mortar. listening so they know where I am roughly. But they don't know 100%. Oh. Nearly didn't see him. Got my wall hack binoculars out again. Oh, they're both wandering off. They're splitting up. Feels like a pistol moment. Oh, he turned around. See, the screen goes a bit dark around the edges. I'm assuming that means, like, I'm, I'm invisible here. Wearing this uniform is like a miniature mobile sauna. <laughs> you are in the middle of a desert. Yeah, it feels like if I go into this grass, it feels like I'm invisible. What I'm going to do is yeet a rock over there. Now, hopefully, he will go and try and follow that rock. He has. Now, how about you? You're not paying much attention. Death. Don't look at me. Don't look at me. Kill the fuck. Got him. Oh, we got lucky. There was another guy up there. And another one. Okay, they're our next targets. Can I loot him? Yes, I can. I won't loot the other guy because he's a little bit out in the open. Last thing we want to do is uh, is get ourselves killed. Do, do, do. Don't mind me. Don't mind me. I'm just here to murder you. Do, 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 do. There's another one right there. We're just going to have to take you down, buddy. Oh, so gruesome. Oh, there's a grenade. Ouch. That really hurt. He doesn't know where I am, though. They're on alert. Got the headshot on that guy. We do have the AK that I could be using. I may have to go to headshots with that pistol. Oh, God. That barrel. Oh, I got lucky. So lucky I got away from that. Big booms. And the music stopped, so we must be okay. <laughs> I'm not even kidding. That's the best way to know whether you're going to be all right or not. Just wait for the music to tell you. Okay. All right, let's see what we've got going on here. Oh my goodness. 1,600 meter sniping. Or well, 1,400? Yeah, 1,400. Yes, depending on how far away things are. 1,500 meter sniping. Right. Once he moves. Am I going to land? Oh, it went further. He's in such a difficult position. I go for 13. Once he moves back again, we might get another chance here. Come on. 
There we go. Is that going to hit two people? It is going to hit two people. Oh. Yikers. Sniper's looking at me. Is there like a sniper position? Yeah, there is a sniper. Look. He's over here. Much easier to line up a shot on a sniper that's not moving. <laughs> oh, no. oh, there's another one. There's another one. Look at that one. Oh, those shots are coming in hard. Let me just go prone for a minute. I'm going to reload. And I need to pick out the sniper. There he is. 1,461 meters. Scale to 1,400. Goodbye. <laughs> it's so weird getting used to, like, not shooting in the center of the scope. Oh, man, it's satisfying. It's so satisfying. Boom. Right, let's get out of there. Oh, here we go. Control, it's Raven. Do you read me? Wow. Okay. Loud and clear, Raven. I'm nearly at the OP for the Not communication for, uh, facility. <laughs> I bet you see it. So inside one of the buildings. Oh, it's a solar array. I need to get him out. Nice. All that comms equipment will draw a lot of power. Plenty of possible targets. I might do it. Or at least get him to look out of a window. Left side, mark one one and one two. Ah, and two right one and two two over two, here. And two, two. Ooh, you have heavy boy. Looks like they're hooked into the satellites. Yeah, he's a heavy boy. The heavy is no a slow, well-armored no enemy with a light machine gun. It's impossible to kill without heavy or armor-piercing bullets, poison bat, poison gas-based weapons, or high explosives. Well, I mean, I could try and take this guy out with a uh, with an explosive bullet. That would be fun. So, right, I've got to take out control. I've run recon, That's a sniper. No visual on the primary. You need to take this guy out he first is of all. confirmed on site, Raven. We're tracking signals from that location. Right, here we go. Shit. He's inside then for sure. Right, 830 meters. Outside. The question is, how? I'll leave that up to you. We'll start by killing the sniper. Oh, that is just gruesome. He has been just destroyed. And because there's no one near him, that means that no one's going to notice him at all. So I can take out... Now, normally, like, in the last two bases, there were two snipers. Let's just have a look at the roofs. And okay, no one up there. We've already done that bit. Hmm. Ah. There you go. Another sniper. Let's take this guy out as well. Thousand meters. Zero to that. In the head. Because that means those two snipers can't shoot back at me. No. <laughs> <laughs> the brain's coming out the side of the hat. Goodness me. Right, okay, so it's my job now to take out these um, positions. So what I'm going to do is down in the bottom right, you'll see I'm switching bullets there. Uh, I'm going to switch the EMP bullet. Hopefully means. That is how far? 923, so we'll just zero down to 900. EMP, boom. One down. That confuses the people that are around it. We're not sure whether this oh. is good. One of the antenna's voltage is unstable. Interesting. So they mentioned something like me doing that. So if I take out the second one. It looks like I disabled the first antenna. There we go. Good work. This should get Novikov's attention. Keep an eye out for him. We but have then... an audio signal. Oh, okay. Bad news. One of the antennas has completely powered down. Can't you people fix anything? It's been broken so many times that you should be experts at it by now. Oh, he doesn't sound very happy. He does not sound happy. Okay. But there are two people at that one, which makes it a little bit harder to land a shot, but... There you go. That one's down as well. And there's the final one. We have a weird reading. It looks like voltage fluctuation in one of the antennas. Nice. We've intercepted okay. their conversation. Oh. There we go. There he is. Colonel Fyodor Novikov. He's outside and on the move. 
Let's see yeah, if we can take this man down. Affirmative, but he's moving. I only have one on uh, EMP enough. bullet left. So, like I said, what I'm going to try and do is I can alarm. take him down with an explosive bullet. Ideally, let me see what I can figure out. You spook him, and you may not get a second shot. Control out. So he is moving closer. So he's going to come and inspect these ones first of all. Okay. He's closing the gap. So I've zero to nine hundred. Again, there's no point in me taking this shot until he stopped moving. Otherwise, I'm just going to miss. Oh, he's actually come behind cover. Right. Okay. We'll have to see what that does. All right, I'll tell you what. He'll come, like, round here. Or maybe cut through there. Maybe he'll cut through there. Either way, I should have a pretty clean shot on him um, as he comes round to this. I really want to take this guy out. Like, I would actually get a kill shot right now. But that would just spook this guy, and he'd run away. And obviously, he's the main target. So we've got to take him down first. I can take down more people once I've done this. Oh, there we go. Oh, he's standing right behind the heavy. But well, we've got to take the shot then, haven't we? <laughs> the explosive worked. One of my better shots. That was insane. Loved that. Data on previous engagements. Ready? Explode. Oh, just again. missed him. Ready again. Boom. He's dead. I'm not gonna am I gonna land that? Ready? <laughs> oh, that's so much fun. Is there any way I can actually make an explosion? None of them are gonna land any shots on me. I'm too far away. Ready? Uh, I'm going to switch to normal bullets now. I'm going to finish off a few more people here because this is actually so much fun. Killing people at longer range. Here we go. Interesting you don't get the bullet travel when you use the explosive bullet, but you get to see the explosion as it lands. Such a cool feeling. That's... <laughs> oh, that's brilliant. I love that. Right, 915. Oh, he's moving. Is that going to land? No, he got behind cover. I do like that. Is that going to land? He stood up. <gasps> he survived within an inch of his life. But unfortunately, there's another bullet heading straight his way. <laughs> oh my god, I blew his helmet off. <laughs> I'm having way too much fun doing this. I have 20 bullets left. How many more ways can we get people here? Right, you're pretty close. In fact, I didn't even mark you. I didn't even mark you. Marked you now. And unfortunately, I've thrown a rock there. I'm just going to zero in. Is that going to hit? No, because you moved. That's going to hit. That one looks like it might go through the teeth. Oh, yes, it goes through the lower part of the face. What have we got here? That guy is closer to 900 meters. I don't even think I'm going to be able to get a kill shot on that guy. God, I'm, I'm absolutely terrorizing this group right now. Go on, hit. Oh, he moved. He's out of cover. Into the face. Let's go. And there's literally no face left. It's all gone. A <laughs> <The> giant egg. <laughs> Okay, that guy's 902. Oh, he's going back behind cover. Okay, fair play, fair play. Who else can we get? You're out of cover. Now you're going back into cover, okay. You're looking around. <laughs> I love it when you're zoomed in and you don't get the bullet camera because then you get just the best sound when you get the kill get another bullet cam here. This one's coming in super fast. Smash. Oh, he went straight, straight across the side of his head. Oh, right. We got 14 bullets. What are we going to get? We're going to see that one. Oh, it missed. So I need to stay scoped in as the shot lands. No, that's a miss. He's up again. That's a chest shot. He's dead. <laughs> 
we get that one? Oh, we got him just behind cover. Skin the top of his brain. Helmet off. Face gone. You've only just realised there's a sniper. I've been here for quite some time, buddy boy. Alerting nearby sectors. That's not good. Oh, missed him. He's moved into cover. Looks like we've got a couple of people left. Let's just reload here. Here we go. Get this guy as well. Smash. No complete destruction of the skull this time. Just a large hole in the back of his head. I don't know if I'm going to be able to get this guy. We're going to get him. We did get him. I think that's everybody cleared out. Perfect. And here we go. Back at the exfil point. I think that was the last one because those were the three people that we were tasked with killing. So I think that's the end of of this mission. Yeah, we did it all. Literally did. We eliminated Antoine Zar Zaza, <laughs> Captain Ronald Payne, and Fyodor Nokivov, and we sabotaged the antennas by taking out the uh, by taking out the two power units. So that was pretty cool. And look, that was only 34% completion on the sabotage of the antennas. There's so much more you can actually do within each of these. Really cool. Really enjoyed that.